Okay, guys, so we just spawned in on the very first spot here. What you'll notice, one cool thing about this map, guys, if you actually push left on the D-pad, you get this micro-missile launcher. Oh, that would have been so nice. Oh, I hit. Let's go. Yes. Oh, I just freaking hit Marku. Well, o'clock midnight. Yes, I just hit. I just hit. Oh my god. <laughs> yes, I finally hit. Holy shit. You can tell how long this t has taken because it's no longer daylight. It's like I got my bedroom line on. Frick yeah, I'm on 29 kills. That's my birthday. Let's go. The bullet trail though, like come on man, what are you doing? Yeah, he's he's always a... I don't think Hendrix kills Oh! I just hit! I didn't jump off! No! A little late for the intro, I know, but anyways, what's going on guys? Inky here, welcome to some campaign trick training, episode 3, playing the map in the darkness. Now, I don't know if you guys have noticed so far, but I actually was playing with Rayvay. Turns out his audio stuffed up, so I didn't record any of his audios in the previous footage, other than that very last segment. So for that reason, guys, seeing that the video's been solo so far, I thought I might as well finish this video off solo. So for the rest of the video, I'm just going to be playing by myself, which means it'll be a little more difficult to hit because I have to hit all the shots by myself. But anyways, it is what it is, so let's continue on. By the way, guys, this map is by far my most favorite map for campaign trick shooting just because it's got so many six spots to trick shot from. Like, you guys can trick shot from any spot you want. Now, the spot we're approaching now is one of my least favorite spots on this map just because everyone knows about it and it is so easy to hit from because there's so many enemies. But, anyways, it's pretty cool. It is a little glitch spot, so I'll quickly show you guys. So here's the pole, boys and girls. All you gotta do is double jump to the top, and what you'll notice there's so many enemies down there. That's why this shot is a little easy to hit. However, when you guys go for this shot, you have got to hit it pretty quickly because Hendrix will actually end up killing all the enemies and then there'll be no one left. Then you got to jump off and you got to respawn back at that freaking annoying spot. But anyways, let's hit this live. I'm hitting it now. I'm calling it, fellas. I'm freaking calling it. I'm about to... I'm going to die, though. This is going to be suicide. Oh, I hit! Yes, 31 kills! I just hit on the suicide shot. I freaking called it, everyone. Holy crap. Okay, guys. So whilst I spawned back here, I want to quickly show you guys a glitch spot because me and Rayvay found this earlier. However, like I said, I didn't get his recording to anything, so I actually deleted the footage. But all you got to do is double jump onto these kind of solar panels, whatever they are. And then you can double jump onto this light post. And as you can see, all the enemies line up on that bridge there. So you guys can hit some insane shots. We've reached the next trick shot spot, fellas. So if you guys come here, you can actually use this mobile armory. And once you get here, you can actually change your class, which is pretty sick. So that's what I'll be doing right now. I'll probably use this class. I'm not actually level 20 yet. As you can see at the bottom there, I'm halfway through level 19. So I'm so close to get overkill. And I can't wait because honestly, my combos will be so much sicker. I've already reached this checkpoint, fellas. So if you don't actually come to this checkpoint, what you'll notice, Hendrix will stand there. When he stands there, you hit friendly fire shots on him. But for the purpose of this video, I'm not going to be going for it just because I don't think it's really that good of a shot to go for. But if you 
you guys want to with the Locust, it, you've got to put six bullets into him and then with the seventh you will bill him. With the SVG, you want to put four into him and then you bill him with the fifth one. But the shot I want to show you guys right now, once again, I'm not going for this shot just because it's so insane. This is the type of shot you guys will come first in Randers top five if you happen to hit it. So what you want to do, jump on top of this sky bridge, you want to reach the checkpoint here. And once you reach the checkpoint, what will happen? You'll notice enemies spawn in there. Now, if we didn't hit that checkpoint, they wouldn't have spawned there. Now, this shot is freaking crazy, guys. Like I said, this is a shot that will make first on everyone's campaign's top five. So, I've been going for it a little bit yesterday, and I just could not get anywhere close to hitting it. So, I really don't know what's going to happen. Like, my shots are kind of on. What will happen as soon as you go for the shot? It's pretty cool, because you can go for multiple attempts. You just jump in this water here. And then you come up the stairs and you can just go for it again. But what will happen after two attempts, the enemies actually run away. And because I've been talking so long, normally you do get two attempts. We only got one because I was talking. So they've actually disappeared. As soon as that happens, you got to kill yourself and then go for it again. You get another two attempts, kill yourself. That's why it's so hard to hit. I'd love if one of you guys hit that. Because if you don't know already, I've actually started my Clip of the Week series again. So I'll be taking campaign shots as well. So please submit clips if you hit. Now, this is a spot I will be going for in this video, guys, so I don't know how many hours I'm going to be sitting here to hit this, but basically what you want to do, come to this checkpoint here, and then what you can do, actually, we'll come around the front here. So there is an easy way to get up. You can either, oh shit, we've got to wait for this rubble to go away. So once that goes away, you can jump yourself onto the sky bridge, and what will happen, Hendrix will actually stand there on the corner. So you can keep going for friendly fire shots over and over again, because what will happen, as soon as you fall... You just kind of swim automatically to this kind of junk pile, and then you can jump up onto the sky bridge and go for it again. So we'll just wait a little bit, and yeah, I'll cut to the scene when Hendrix finally appears there, because it literally takes a solid two minutes. Okay, people, here he comes. Go, Hendrix, go. And there he is, fellas. He's freaking standing there. So I believe with the Locust, it takes seven bullets to kill. So we'll put six bullets into him, and then we can bill him. Two, three, four, five. Oh, okay. Maybe it takes five. Tomorrow. Ooh. Oh no, I just hit on my second bullet, guys. Day two. Oh my god, the bullet trail was skinned in, no way. Day three. Shit, guys, you don't understand how long I've been going for this for. Yes! Guys, this is the third day since that previous recording. I've literally been going for this for like four hours straight, and I just hit it. Because every time I went for it, I had two minutes to trick shot, and then he regained his health, so I had to kill him and reset it, then I have to do it all over again, and I freaking donged it. Oh my god, yes! Five hours later. I'm back, guys. As you can tell, it's a little late. I ended up having dinner. As you would have seen from the previous clip, my Elgato actually stuffed up on that clip. It's not a massive deal. All it means is it's in 30 frames per second, not 60 frames per second, because that's the share play. But anyways, it is what it is. As you can see, I'm back in the safe house, because if you happen not to realize already, I'm actually level 20, which means I can finally get overkill. So we make pretty dope class for this final trick shot spot. So I'll quickly make a class right now, and then we'll just jump straight back into it and hit the most insane shot ever. Well, the shot I just hit is probably by far the best campaign shot I've ever here, but this next one is going to be pretty good, but not as good. Oh my god, here it is, guys. Overkill it honestly feels so freaking amazing. And with this class, I'm going to put on the KRM 262. This gun looks really nice for cockbacks. Actually, no, I'm not, guys. I'm putting on the Argus because I actually unlocked a pretty mad camo before. I've never seen heat. And of course, the SVG because I'm scared of hit markering. Welcome, guys, to the final trick shot spot on the map in the darkness. Man, I just quickly say that this cam on the Argus actually looks really, really clean. Sorry, I can't actually show you guys properly because what you'll notice, I can't double jump here, can't bring up my weapons, can't do anything. So you're probably wondering, how do you trickshot from this spot called the zipline? 
basically what you want to do, you want to come down the zip line. So don't go down that zip line. You want to come down this zip line. And this spot is honestly such a sick spot, guys. I saw Brett Random hit a shot from here, and I was like, how the hell did you get there? And then I kind of worked it out myself. But there is a good spot from here that I found myself. Oh, shit, that was really bad. Okay, that's not what you want to do. You basically just want to double jump onto the zip line, and then you want to run up here. Yeah, you can't double jump on top of that zip line. That's why you want to come on this one. And what you'll notice, so this is a glitch spot everyone knows about. You can't double jump properly from here, so it's kind of a bit awkward. As you can see, all the enemies are down there. There's actually quite a few, but the spot I found accidentally is this spot right here. So I just went for a shot one day and accidentally landed on here. And what you'll notice, if you jump from here, you can actually double jump, and holy shit, the enemies are shooting at me. I shouldn't have shot my gun now. I'm probably going to die. You can double jump here, no barrier, and it's a little more distance. All the enemies are down there, so let's quickly go for a shot, and let's end this video off strong with a really sick donger at the end. I'll slightly overspan that, but anyways, let's just skip straight to the shot. How come you're so on the Twitter now? Like, what's, Twitter's pointless unless you have a big YouTube channel. I'm gonna grow. <gasps> oh, freaking hit marker! No! I told you I'll hit marker! Wait! Wait! I did hit! Wait, I was looking at your score! I was looking at yours! I'm on 3! Shit! I was looking at 81! Yes! Finally! That only took freaking hours!